think first I'd say what a what a highly competitive game out of both teams. And um, we had our points where we could have broke. Uh, they had their points where they could have broke. Both teams had guys step up and make plays. But I, I think in the overall picture for both universities, I, I'd say this. I think this is a great event for both universities. I, I think when you when you talk about recruiting and you talk about um, recruiting Illinois kids, there were a lot of Illinois kids out there making plays today. And I hear that a lot out in the recruiting world. And, and really, uh, you know, I, I, I get tired of it because there are very good Illinois kids on both these teams. And, and if, if you were watching it today, you saw them making really good plays. Go ahead. Coach, talk a little bit about your freshman play today. They scored at least 60% of your points and they, they showed no fear out there. Well, I think, again, and, and when you take over a program and you talk process, people start to go, well, at what point do we see a reward for the process? Because all fans look at is winning and losing. This is the fifth time I've rebuilt a program. They're, they're learning where the shots come. They're learning how to get more comfortable. They're learning what, what our system is. And I've, and I've really got 13 freshmen. So I think they relaxed. Every game they get more comfortable, and they're getting a feel for their teammates. And so that's why they got easier shots today. They got shots when they were ready to shoot. And we went from being a bad shooting team to a good shooting team because of great play. Not, not Illinois was guarding hard, and we made the extra pass, got the wide open shot, and we knocked some down. That's that's what the freshmen are getting better at every time. How much how much does it impact them that they're they're missing some people in their front court? Illinois? Yes. Well there's no question you're missing LaRon Black, who is a kid I recruited in Indiana. Um, and he's a hard working, garbage, play hard, really defend for him, really rebound. So I, I think John's went through a whole period here where he hasn't had his whole team. And so I, I think, no question, he, he, they miss him on the front line because he gives them another athlete on the front line. Now you're talking about the freshman. What about Dominique's performance early on, starting off with the 14 of the first 15 points of the game? Well, and, and again, as Dikembe would tell you, I'm probably as hard on those two right now for two freshmen as, as you can be because I need them to grow up quickly. I need them to play like veterans. And yet I knew it's a process of, I thought he came out and relaxed. I thought he didn't force anything. He, he got a rhythm going. And then his teammates did a good job of going, he's, he's, he's hot right now, find him. And kind of the same thing happened in the second half for Dikembe. All of a sudden he got going and they were finding him. That's a maturity factor for our team, but it's a maturity factor for two young freshmen that I'm asking to do a lot. For either of those players, despite the losses, is a bit of a confidence builder. Uh, I'd say we're definitely disappointed in the loss, but we definitely uh, realize how hard we played. We're definitely proud about that. Um, I don't think, as us as players, we obviously want to get the win. You know? This is definitely hurts, but we're definitely building on it. Kimberly, 